Peugeot PB9010, and it's the world's most powerful backpack blower. What's going on everyone? Vince DeLongineer here. Super excited about this one. This is the Echo PB9010 backpack blower. It is the world's most powerful backpack blower. As a user advisory group member for Echo Means Business, Echo did send this to me to share my thoughts with you and give you my full honest opinion. In this video, we're gonna go over my first impressions. I've had this now for about two weeks. I'm gonna go over its features and everything it can do and kind of tell you a little story about when I first used this blower at GIE. All right, so let me go over the full specs of this blower, starting with the engine. The engine is a monstrous 79.9 cc engine. It is absolutely huge, as you can see here. You know, this is just the size of my hand here, and behind this plastic piece is the engine here. It's huge, guys. Here is the air filter alone on top here. Um, it's, it's like a car filter. Uh, also coming around here to the front is this huge tube. This tube measures almost four inches in diameter. Just coming out of this tube is 1100 cubic feet per minute of air, which is an incredible amount. Add to that 220 miles per hour, which gives you 48 newtons of force. That's about 10.7 pounds of force coming out of the tube. Now, competitors may argue that they have some better specs. However, I attended a presentation a few months ago in Lake Zurich at Echo's headquarters and found out that those competitors are measuring their specs and performance right here. What you may not realize is you have these elbows, you have this corrugated section of flexible tubing, and then your straight piece of pipe here where all of this adds up to losses, right? So you get a loss here of, of air flowing around the bend, you get a loss here going through here, and then those, this length of pipe, you get a loss to where at the end of the tube, it's not the same value. They are not the same performance specs as where they're measuring back here. Echo measures everything from the tip, giving you that raw, untamed power, making them the king, the one on top, making this, the PV9010, the world's most powerful backpack blower. So if you can't tell already, I am really excited about this. Um, and you know my general opinion of this so far my first impressions are very positive however your opinion and your comments really do matter not only do they help me but they also help others so if you have this blower or if you've used other blowers that are of similar caliber please leave a comment below. Let us know what your experience has been with them. Let others know and share your thoughts with everyone else. Also, if you have any questions, please do not hesitate to ask them down below in the comments. I do my best to answer every single question. And if I don't know the answer, I will do my best to find one for you. Make sure you comment down below. So I actually first saw the PB9010 at GIE in Kentucky back in October of 2021. And I got to demo it in their demo area. And it was such a cool demonstration. What they had was a setup uh, under a tent with bricks, bricks and block. And you're basically blowing around these bricks. I mean, the amount of force coming out of that tube is enough to move bricks so easily. Um, this blower, is intended to really be that workhorse for like leaf cleanups, really thick brush. Um, if you're clearing like, say, let's say for instance, wet grass, like no problem, this thing will blow it all. Right now I've got a little bit of a project here where I'm filling in the garden in the backyard with some of this fill dirt. And at the end of the job, I come back around with the blower and all the dirt that's been caked on the sidewalk, that's been trampled on, stepped on, and just pressed into the concrete. This PB9010, piece of cake. Blows it, blows it right up. All right, so one of the things I wanna demonstrate for you, really to demonstrate how powerful this machine is, I've got these rocks here, right? You know, just look at the size of these rocks. These rocks are huge, right? They've got a good amount of weight to them. I wanna show you how powerful this blower is. All right, raw 
untamed power. You ready? Let's go. Another thing I want to demonstrate here is how well this blower will blow wet grass. I know that when working, when it's raining or when the grass is really wet, like early morning mows and stuff like that, the clumping is an issue. The amount of grass that ends up on the sidewalk that then just sticks to the sidewalk can be an issue to blow. With the PB9010, it's no problem. Let me demonstrate. So right here, I just dumped a bunch of grass clippings I had in my mower bag, and I came over with uh, a hose and, and wet it all down, soaked it in real good. Let's show you how easy it is and effortless it is for the PB9010 to clear all this stuff up. All right, here we go. and absolutely incredible one of the other things i like about this backpack blower are these straps these straps super thick very well padded um, and really take a lot of the pressure off your back with all the different adjustments you can pull up here to get things right and square to your back pull down on the on the strap down here to really fit it to you um, and you know, although this is a heavy backpack blower, um, when you're using it, there's so much power coming out of this tube right here that it actually lifts the backpack up off your back. Um, and as you're using it, it's, it's not weightless, but it's definitely way lighter, more comfortable and doesn't, you know, if you're using this all the time and you're blowing with it, there's like no fatigue at all. So this is the tube throttle mounted control. Um, so basically up is to turn it off. You click once down to start it. You can control and hold the throttle using this lever here or with your fingers, control the throttle like so. Push it all the way up to turn off the machine. Um, they also have the hip mounted throttle where you would have more like the, the hip movement right here to control the throttle. I opted for the tube, just preference, but they do have both available if you're interested in that. Real quick note about X-Series. X-Series is Echo's branding for their best in class products. So PB9010, of course, is an X-Series product. So if you are a landscaper or own a landscaping business, this is definitely a tool you want to have on your truck. Um, this thing is going to really serve as a major workhorse for you, your crew, everything from leaf blowing and cleaning up sidewalks after mowing um, to even cleaning out some of these like beds like I had just shown you. Probably not the best for you know, clearing out like mulch beds because it'll just blow the mulch out of the out of the way. But if you've got like these stone beds, you could definitely get the dirt up and out from those stone beds. You might have to go back and rake some of those stones back into place. But this thing is definitely a must have for that. Um, it is backed by Echo's five year residential, two year commercial warranty, which is really good if you are an individual wanting to use this on your personal property, residential type work. Um, this is about a $630 blower. Uh, it's definitely, you know, one of the more expensive blowers, um, but you pay for what you get and you will not be disappointed with a blower like this, especially if you have a larger property, a property with tons and tons of trees where, you know, once, you know, all those leaves fall, you're working every other day to clear those leaves out. This will make short work of it. I promise you it's going to be incredible and you'll love it. 
Another thing I want to mention is that with all of the different regulations going on around the country, different states enforcing uh, bans on, you know, small engine equipment like this, specifically blowers, uh, you know, like the, the gas ban on blowers in California, for example, um, it's very possible that we won't see any engineering marvel like this again. Um, it's very possible this could be the very last world's most powerful backpack blower. That's me speculating. That's my guess, uh, prediction for the future, if you will. Um, but if you were looking for something like this, don't wait, don't hesitate, just get it before you can't anymore. So there's really only one thing that I'm not a fan of on this blower, and that is you, you do have to pull start it while on the ground. That's very typical amongst a lot of other backpack blowers. I think steel is the only one that has like the side pull, um, which I hear is pretty good and um, would probably be the only thing I would really wanna see on a blower like this. Um, because you know I've, I've hit the switch a couple times and accidentally have turned it off and when you're in the middle of the job, you gotta take your backpack off and you gotta restart it. That's probably, at this moment, my only criticism of this backpack blower. Not the end of the world, just trying to find something um, that I could share with you that's, that's, that's more of a, maybe a negative comment about it. But other than that, this thing rocks. I mean, I'm really looking forward to using it this season. I will follow up with a full review after putting a whole season of time on it and getting some more experience with it, especially when we get into the leaf cleaning season this year. Really looking forward to using this and showing you guys how it works for the leaf cleanups. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and thank you for joining.